Well, hello there. Let's play some Blood Bowl Legendary Edition. If you're not aware, this game is set in the Warhammer universe, just like Warhammer Online. But it's based around the rules of American football. Based really, 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 really loosely. I'm playing this game because I am putting off doing something. I kind of feel like recording something. Uh, I'm practicing this game because I'm going to be playing this online with a few of my friends, so I need to get a bit of practicing. And so they can uh, see how I fail it and go, Ruffle, 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 Ruffle. I've been watching too much Grimmeth. And, uh, yeah, just see how, how terrible I am at this game. But, I mean, I am new to this game. Single player. I am new to it. Uh, this is my like my, my second match, I'll say. Well, it is third match, but the first match my friends were here, we were kind of messing around with it, so... If you're not sure about any of the stuff that you're seeing, I'm not going to explain it, because I really don't know either. Basically, I'm picking a team, and these are all the races that you can be, and honestly, I, 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 I don't... Um, I have played Warhammer, like I played it quite extensively in my teen years, so I know what all these are, pretty much. But how good they are in the game of Blood Bowl, I'm not sure. I have actually played the board game of this as well, because this was a, a board game. Um, well, it still is a board game that uh, I've actually played quite a lot, and um, well, not quite a lot. Why do I say that? I've played it, um, so I have a vague understanding about how it works. Let's say, um, but the intricacies of everything are a complete mystery to me. Necromantic uh, zombies, ghouls, whites, flesh golems, werewolves, and more zombies. Hmm, that's movement. That's strength, so they hit harder. That's agility, so they can dodge stuff. And that's ammo value, so they can... I don't know what that does, really. Uh, probably the higher it is, the less prone they are to being a, uh, injured. Um, necromantic, maybe... Lizard men. Hmm, no. Dark undead. How's it? Vampire. Do I want to play in a team with six vampires in it and a load of thralls? I think so. Vampires... Mm, yeah. So what we're looking at here is pretty much a team of average people and better than average people, I think. I think three is about average for strength and agility. So far is better. Again, not excellent, but still pretty good. If I was to pick a better team... Yeah, there's still vampires and thralls. There's no, like, demons and stuff that appear. Maybe vampires. I really shouldn't take up too much time on this. Let's just have another look. Like, say, maybe... I've just played a game with Chaos against humans, and I drew nil-nil. Uh, I made a few rookie mistakes. So I'm hoping to correct that. We could play halflings, and then we get tree men that are, like, pretty much uh, tree beard out of a lot of the rings. But then you get halflings, who suck. You know, they move really slow, they're really weak, they're average agility, and they have a very low armor class. So you get tree men who are really kick-ass and awesome, but can't move, and halflings. They're not, this, no, not halflings. Equally, ogre is pretty much the same thing. Ogre is very strong, pretty slow. Snodlings, um, very, very, very weak. They're basically just fodder. I suppose you do all of your work with your ogres. Which actually kind of maybe appeals to me, honestly. They also have various skills. I have absolutely no idea what any of them do, really. I have a vague idea about some of the basic ones, like dodge and block. And throw teammates, so I guess he could throw a snottling who are really small, because they're stunty. I'm going into too much detail of this. I'm not going to be ogres anywhere. Skaven, rat men. Hmm, hmm. No. Ooh, I don't know. Maybe undead. Mummies, white school zombies. What about skeletons? I thought skeletons were undead. Hmm. Pretty hard to kill these guys. Yeah, you can actually... Oh, look, they've got, like, a, a skeletal fish. That's got to be one in my book, I, I imagine, really. And they've also got one cheerleader. One undead cheerleader. Drowned and dead, time for bloodshed. Oh, they were drowned, that's why they got that. I get it, okay. 
Mummy's very strong but very slow. I'm not really sure whether I... <laughs> I don't know which team I want. You can play as Amazons and play as women. I don't want to play a girl. No. Um, oh, uh, hmm. Yeah, this is very exciting, isn't it? Uh, an ergle. Diseased, horrible people. That actually kind of appeals. Though they're not really that strong, I suppose they are. Nurgle warriors are pretty strong. Not very agile, though. Because you're not going to get a team that's really agile and really strong. That would... Um, you know, be a little bit too... Overpowerful? Overpowering? Um, this team looks pretty well-rounded, actually. I think that maybe... They all have not hypnotic gaze. Um, that's actually pretty good. I think I'm going to go with uh, these vampires. Again, I can pick a really brilliant team, but I'm just they'll have loads of different skills and stuff, so I'm going to pick the basic one with just the two-star rating, except now I have to pick who I'm against. <laughs> so I'm going to look away and scroll them down and pick that one. That was that was random. A goblin. Goblin, eh? Goblins. Well, goblins have trolls. They can also throw <laughs> bombs and... Oh, God. And yeah, some have a pogo stick. Absolutely. Let's play against the goblins. And we have the same equal value of teams. Let's pick a different stadium. Like, it doesn't really matter. I just wanted to, like... Mm, eh, that one looks interesting. And watch the game. Difficulty medium. So, uh, yeah, the Vampire Coast Swashbuckler versus the Southern Squig Chasers. Let's, yeah, launch the game. Launch the game. No, I don't want to do any of that rubbish. Yes. No petty cash. Just start the game. Don't want to be doing with extra rerolls or bribes or anything like that. We're just going to continue like this in a very basic game. Again, I have a uh, vague understanding about the basic mechanics, but I will make mistakes. If you guys want to offer me any advice, and not just like obvious advice, but you know, like pro tips or anything against my friends, uh, that would be good. Also, uh, no, I don't want to play you at this game. My friend got me this uh, as a gift uh, to, to play with her and, and a bunch of other people, and that's what I'm going to use it for. Uh, I think the cinematic will last forever. My god, that's a big troll. But my vampires have capes. Yeah, let's go ahead and skip that. Oh, wait a minute, it's starting, isn't it? Uh, oh, what? No... No coin toss? Alright, I would be the kicker, because I, I don't want to be receiving anything. <laughs> okay, let's organise our team. So I guess these guys are the vampires with the... You're a vampire. You're a vampire. So the thralls look... This is quite a dark, uh, dreary kind of... Uh, arena here. I'm kind of regretting choosing it, but no matter. Uh, what, why would I have a thrall... Why would I have three thralls in my in my front row? Or whatever you might say. Whatever it is. I don't, I don't know. I, I, guys, I don't, I don't, I don't know these, these terminologies for, I want my vampires. Oh, of course, they're bloody trolls though, aren't they? Trolls have a strength of five, but agility of one, so they're not going to get the ball, but they're going to actually pound the hell out of me. Also, chains, <coughs> chains, oh! Also, uh, a knob kit, I don't even know what that is. Also, bombs, also... Pogo stick. And their cheerleaders are riding these squigs. That's a squig, by the way. Yeah, don't ask. Where's my cheerleaders? They're, oh, I'm pleasantly surprised. Yes, please. Okay, anyway. On with the game. Oh, just kick the goddamn ball. Oh, do I kick the ball? Oh, yeah, I forgot that. I'm kicking the ball. Kick it over there. Kick it. Kick it. There we go. Shaboom! Okay. Oh, good. A riot. First thing. Great. A riot. Trash talk between two opposing players and... Blah, 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 blah. Only have 30 seconds, 20 seconds to read this. 
If the receiving team's turn marker is on turn 7 of the... What? Both teams move their turn... This is like Yu-Gi-Oh! It doesn't make any sense. If the receiving team... Oh, uh, 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 Alright. Uh, the referee let the clock run one turn before resuming... The whatever. That's a good kick. That is a good kick. Oh god, now they're going to batter me. They're going to destroy my vampires. No! Get him! Alright, this is... Oh god, yeah, and a fanatic with his whirly ball of death. Awesome. Ow. Ow. That's... No, no, they're destroying me. Yeah, this is a turn pace game. Like in the ball... What the hell? Oh no, that's their, their side. That's fine. Um... Yeah, this is a turn-based uh, game, so... Oh, turnover! But if they fail a roll just like they did then, then it's my go. Okay, so if I can get a guy all the way down there and into that bit there, I have scored a, a goal. A touchdown, even. Huh. Ah, trolls. Great. Well, I'm going to stand my players up first. Stand up. Stand up. 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 Stand up. Stand up. Alright, they won't be able to do anything, but they can assist other players. Now, uh, I currently have no blocks, and blocks is when you start your turn next to another player like that. Then you, I could have blocked him if he hadn't just stood up, and that would have been like an attack, basically. I can also blitz by moving and attacking, but I can only do one of them per turn. And there's lots of modifiers on pluses and minuses, depending on tackle zones and stuff like that that I'm not going to get into, because I don't really understand it at all. I have uh, three minutes to make my turn, and I have no idea what to do at all. I got a pogo stick guy. I got a guy that can throw bombs against me. I got a guy with a chainsaw, and I'm really just not happy about this at all, honestly. I want to take this guy out. Now you actually. Oh, I thought you could move. Well, I'm gonna to have to do a blitz on this goddamn fanatic dude. But not like that, because the two red dice means that he gets to pick the dice that I would get. And that's probably because he's stood right next to him. Not good! Yeah, it's the same there. I don't know why I thought it would be different. Um, Alright, let's take that guy out. Let's just take him out. Uh, I get to push him back. Hooray! Yes, I want to follow up with... Doof! Falco! Okay, judo punch. I don't know. Okay, right. I need to really make some defense here. Defense, defense. Because okay, they're gonna get the ball up there. There's the ball there. He's gonna pick it up with his chain. Oh, well, they've got a chainsaw and a bomber actually, so I don't think they'll be able to pick it up. Agility three, agility f three. Actually, maybe they will. Oh no, it's all gonna go wrong. Let's just. Not put anyone next to him, so he has to make... We can hopefully lure him away from the fanatic dude. That would be nice. Let's put him here. Let's put... Let's move my vampires up. We're going to go for like a... Uh, what? Bloodlust. I got a one required two. Do I want a reroll? How many rerolls do I have? I, I, I think I have two rerolls. They have four? Three, four? What the hell does that mean? I don't know. Anyway, no... What happens if I fail a bloodless thing? You will have to bite a thrall at the end of your action if you... Or you will suffer a turnover. <laughs> really? <laughs> really? Oh. Well, let's... Can you bite him then, please? Go and bite him. That's a thrall, right? Go and... How do I... Oh, what? I was going action vampire. On a roll of a one, the vampire must feed. Vampires suck! Uh, uh, the vampire must feed by, by standing in an adjacent square during the action. Make an injury roll for the thrall. Oh, great! My team's killing each other. That's fantastic. So I can move the thrall over to him. Right? Move the... Th oh, I'm stuck on him. Right, okay. Alright, you go there then. You just go there and bite him next turn. I think that's how it works. You... What? Yeah, bite... Bite the... Th this is going well.
Okay, bite the thrall. It's right there. Bite. Bite the thrall. That is thrall, right? Yeah. Draw drubby wieners. Um. Oh, what? Time limit exceeded. Well, that was awesome. That was brilliant. This is going really well. Awesome. Oh, go away, you bloody fanatic dude. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You just completely batter everyone. Everyone. Just destroy them all. I've decided just now. Oh, he's got the ball. Great. The guy with the chainsaw has got the ball. Well, at least he won't be able to throw it. Or you could just pass it on to that guy. Yeah. Yeah, that could happen. Go on, then form up in a great big mob. Just form up into a great big mob. Oh, yeah. Boingy, 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 boing. Screw you. This is not going well. This is not going great at all. Honestly. This is... Alright, I get to choose the, the, the dice because I have a higher and, uh, and strength. But... Awesomely, they're both the same thing, which knocks us both down, right? Right? Both down. Yeah, great. That's a turnover, though, anyway. So, I, it's my turn now. Hooray! I get to fail some more. And the vampire's gone because he didn't bite the thrall. Even though he's right next to the thrall! I don't know what I'm doing. Stand up. See, I can't get... Oh, this guy is so dead now. In fact, I should really do stuff to... Stand up. Stand... Stand... Oh, he must have just turned over. If they're on the front, they have to turn over before they can stand up. Shows they're even more hurt than before. I don't even know if I can... Uh, turn the camera around, whether this is 3D or not. I don't want to press any buttons in case I hit the wrong that I've got for my toggle key for fraps. Go on with the game! Bloody Variax. Fail, fail, fail. That's all you ever do. Alright, let's stay away from the trolls. And their players and get the ball. What the hell are you doing? Your big wavy hands. Stop getting distracted. Oh, screw it. I'm going to take this. I'm going to take you out. How the hell do I have two dice against me when there's him and him near me? I don't understand how this fanatic ball and chain thing works. I don't like it. Honestly. I want to get away from him as well, really. I want to avoid him, 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 and the guy with the bombs. Him. And we should be fine. Yeah. I've picked the wrong team to be here, I think. Alright, there's a vampire. Oh, he can blitz him. And that's a really good thing to do as well. Or maybe blitz him. No, 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 no. No, stop. Blitz him. At least I'm fast. Why can't I... Yeah, batter him. Even though I know he's like right in the thicker things and he's going to die next turn. At least I'll do something. Oh, God. Oh, I get to push you back. Yes. No! Don't... <laughs> Why did I do that? He could have stayed there and at least be kind of safe. Now he's screwed. <laughs> oh, dear. What's that? It's a thrall. Go on. Oh, I can't back him up. He doesn't move far enough. Damn it. Damn it to hell. And you can't obviously blitz because I just blitzed pointlessly and just ruined one of my guys lives and yeah you can't move through there you'll actually you really should be able to dodge a troll agility four agility one right you should be able to dodge through there go go no do i want to do a re-roll this early in the match no i don't fall over you you got clothesline to hell and you deserved it you really did deserve it oh ow no no i actually dodged wow my god this guy did not kill one of mine oh yes he did yes he did why the hell are i goblins Goblins are kick-ass. Yeah, this guy is so screwed. <laughs> He's dead. <laughs> if I'd have stayed away, I would have, like, forced them to blitz at least and used their blitz on me. Now they could just bring up a troll up and batter me. Is they going to do right there? I dodged. No, I didn't. Oh, ow! What? Oh, at least he fell over. Boing, 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 boing. Bouncing all over the place, you bloody... Go away with your bombs and your bloody chainsaws and stuff. Uh, someone was really stupid. Oh, the troll was really stupid. Yeah, that means that uh, the troll is really stupid, and so it doesn't doesn't move. Doesn't move. Why is this so complicated? Is it my go now? Hooray! Hooray! It's my go. You stand up. Stand up, my players. You can stand up now. Stand up. Why was that a roll? Don't know whether the dice just like. The... 
Oh, okay, right, he just turned over. Fine. You. Okay, I start, can't stand him up either. I'm getting trounced. Vampires suck in this game, I'm telling you. Um. Oh! Oh! Why? Did you just stand up? Oh, God. Yeah, he must have just stood up. Oh, great. I've got no one near anyone. This isn't going... going to plan at all. Really? This, I don't seem to have it as, as many players as them, which I guess because they're goblins they would outnumber me, but they've got trolls and big chainsaws and stuff as well, and it's not fair. Run down there! Offense. Always offense. The best offense is a good offense. Or something. Maybe I could try... No. No. Maybe I could... If I tried it with him, then his troll could just block me, so... See, why is that red dice is not good? Hopefully these guys will all be taken off at half-time because they've all been, like, realized that they have illegal weapons. If I can just hold on for half-time, I might stand a chance in the next half because, you know, their, their weapons can be, like, found out to be illegal, which they are! And, uh... Yeah, I'm gonna put you there. Fodder for that bloody fanatic dude. What's he called? Skew Skewatash or something. Horrible. Nasty horrible. I'm just an innocent little vampire thrall and he comes along and batters me. It's not fair. Alright, you can go there. And I think I'm screwed. I'm done. Done. In a turn. Your go. I did nothing. My last turn went. My last game went way better. It was nil nil, but I know it was fine. I didn't. It was okay, you know. It went okay. Bloody! Why is the chainsaw? Go like, he's really slow. At least he is really slow. I can only move like four four squares or something. Or maybe we just did that voluntarily. Is he going to hand the ball off? I'd really rather he didn't hand the ball off to the guy with the bomb. What's going on? Oh, he's standing up. Okay. Oh, it's... Okay! Excellent. I got a turnover. Awesome. My go to kick some ass. Oh, I can bat him. No, stand players up first. First thing you do is stand players up. I learned that. Stand... Why, why aren't you standing up, dude? Can you stand up? Why can't they stand up? He can stand up. What are you doing? Hooray. Um. Alright, I've got an idea here. Take out that troll. Or at least knock him down for a turn. I don't know what good that'll do me, actually. Let's move some of our guys over to, like, this side. Because I can do that. That's fine. Let's use our quickness. Yeah. Okay, you can go there. Oh, yeah, I didn't want really to move past it. Yeah, that was fine, that was fine. That was a rookie mistake. I didn't realize I had to dodge past that troll there, but that's fine. Alright, now you, batter him. And, uh, what? Both down or push? Do he has, does he have block? I can't even... Oh, wait, it would tell me there. He doesn't. Great. So, uh, I'll push you. Yeah, that won't do me any good whatsoever. Do I want to follow up? I don't think it made much difference. Yes, I want to follow up. Doof! Now, what was my plan there? Didn't I have a plan or something going on? Oh, by him. Oh, what? Attacker down or attacker down? Oh. Why, why? No! Fine, I mean, I don't care. You got beaten up by a goblin, dude. You suck. You got beaten up by a Goblin. Oh, there he is again. There he is again. Wait a minute. He did nothing! You hit nothing with your stupid ball and chain thing. Oh, here he comes. I have nothing in the way of him. I really should start thinking about stopping that dude. Honestly. You know? If I get a bunch of vampires in front of him, he would be dead. And I, I don't know whether that would be true or not. I'm just saying it, really. I'm just saying it. I mean, he just like have like, a swall of... 
Oh, he's, uh, <laughs> his his uh, his troll failed at life. Right, stand up. You. Why aren't you standing up? What the hell? Look, look sudden, he's still like uh, trash talking me. To save face, you can still abandon the game. Why aren't you standing up, dude? What's the matter? What? Oh, okay, maybe you could have done that last time, but I just didn't see. Anyway. Alright, most of my players are on their feet, at least. No, no, you. Get up. No. You'll have to bite a throw at the end of your action turn. Well, you're on the ground! Alright, get up. There's a thrall. Oh, I've got to use hypnosis manually? That sucks. Alright, go there. Yes, just, just, yeah. Okay, dodge away from that. Now, there's a thrall. Eat, eat the thrall. Doesn't tell me how to actually do it though. It says you must bite the thrall. You must bite the thrall. But how? He's right there. Bite him. Bite the thrall. What's that star mean? No idea. There's a star there anyway. I mean, you know, like these these do nothing. What, what was that? Nothing. What the hell are you doing, dude? You know, you're stopping me from doing anything, and then my time's gonna run down because you won't. There's a thrall. Yum yum yum. Lovely lovely thrall. Eat. The thrall. I know there's people yelling at the screen here to say, "Do this! It's just right there. You've got to just just click on the button there. It's really obvious, but it isn't obvious. It's not obvious. It should be one of these, surely. You know, these are his abilities, right? When the time comes, you know." Yeah. This is awesome. Let's read what it says. On a result of one, the vampire must feed. However, he may continue with his declared action, or if he had declared a block action, he may take a move action instead. At the end of the declared action, but before actually passing, handing off, or scarring, the vampire must feed on a thrall teammate by standing in an adjacent square during the action. What? Make an injury roll for the thrall. What? So he's got to do an action? Alright, wait a minute. I, I don't know what you want from me, game. What? Do you want... Nope. I don't get it. I don't get it. End of action. End, you know, you choose the thrall to bite. Oh my god! That one. Ah. <sighs> Uh, badly hurt, no, uh, well, why, why not? Oh, because it's only one, I only get one cure, so, no, it's only a thrall. Oh, thanks, game. Alright, now i got no more time to do anything. Awesome. Batter him. Yeah, oh, both down. God, my rolls are sucking. Oh, I got blocked, though. Awesome. Alright, the end of turn, you'll go. Great. Great. That that thing up there, that button there, normally means like you know end of turn, but when that's happening, it means oh no no, it actually means that that's just you know that that action is that's over. Hmm. Great. <laughs>